more help from UI and feedback when you make important choices. Definitely doing that. Episode one, a new day. Let's do it. Let's get it. lowered it it is loud as hell bro have to lower the audio it's crazy loud i don't know why i don't know why it's so goddamn loud okay wow even in a fucking zombie apocalypse dude racism white supremacy never changes huh well, I reckon you didn't do it then. Oh, wow. Wait, is there a timer? What the fuck? Does it really matter? Nah, not much. You know, I've driven a bunch of fellas down to this prison. Lord knows how many. Usually it's about now I get the, I didn't do it. Wow, I was trying to flex. And what do you say? I say, yep, I know you didn't. That's it? That's weird. I followed your case a little bit. You being a making boy and all. Oh, making. Oh, Georgia. Right? You're from Macon, then. Yep. Came up to Atlanta to be a city cop in the 70s. I always wanted to work a murder case, like that senatorial mess you got yourself mixed up in. Wait. All right, one more setting, one more setting. Why would the subtitles be fucking off, bro? I don't understand. Show reticle buttons, mouse sensitivity. Should I show reticle buttons too? No, fuck that. With all due respect, a real shame that is. Hell. Whole family used to be regulars at your folks' drugstore right in downtown. Still there? Sure is. Good. Any of that seem important to you? All of it. But that box never shuts up. Sit in this seat and pay too much attention and you'll drive yourself crazy. I got a nephew up at UGA. You teach there long? Going on my sixth year. You meet your wife in Athens? You want to know how I see it? Sure. Regardless, could be you just married the wrong woman. What did I do? <sighs> what the hell did I do, bro? Wait, why didn't she? Why didn't he answer that? Did I click on the wrong thing? Okay. I'm driving this man once. He he was the worst one. He wouldn't stop going on about how he didn't do it. He was an older fella, big soft eyes behind a pair of smart folk glasses, and he just wailing back there. Says it wasn't him. Crying and snotting all over right where you're all sitting. Are available for coming to one then before long, he starts kicking the back of the seat like, like a fussy baby on an airplane. Not tell him he's got to stop, but that's government property, and I'll be forced to zap him otherwise. So he stops, and having exhausted all his options, he starts crying out for his mama. 
Mama, it's all a big mistake. It wasn't me. Why is he so fucking stoked about a, a dude that he is like robbing of his fucking freedoms right now? Like I robbed so many at the top of the hour with a three minute ad break from the freedom of seeing the fucking stream uninterrupted. Because at the top of the hour, there's a three minute ad break. If you no longer want to see those ads, all you need to do is subscribe for $5 or for free, baby. That's right. That's right. Proven. Guilty until proven innocent. That's how I seize it. Many of y'all are proven unsubscribed until I see those subscriptions at the top of the god dang hour. That's right. Hell yeah, brother. Raise hell. Praise Dale. Here's a three-minute ad break now. You literally are that driver with ad breaks? Yeah, that's right. I am. I'm the sheriff around these parts. I'm the gosh darn sheriff. Here, I'm fucking spamming that link, too. Urging y'all to retweet and like and and organize around so you can get your friends in to watch me play this gosh darn game all right let's go baby was innocent innocent they caught the fucker red-handed stabbing his wife cutting her up as the boys came through the door he sits in my car screaming bloody murder that it wasn't him I think he actually believed it himself. It goes to show. I love the art style so far. mad when they believe their life is over. I got another good one for you. This one's a little bit less depressing and a bit more hilarious if I do say so. What's this out? other time? <laughs> zombie apocalypse activities that's just like regular cop shit on any given sunday dude i swear to god wait what the fuck is there like actual shit that i need to do on this game holy fuck cops drive like shit average cop death you know what i mean ggs Lost a QCE. Ah, fuck my leg. Where the fuck the cop go? Oh shit! Hey, hey, officer, are you all right? I'm still cuffed back here. Bro, not sure if he's all right or not. Wait, look what at the, the show. Did he have his gun out? Oh shit. <laughs> I don't think he can break that that easily. I need to drag myself out that window. Use move forward using the W key. Look at the door. Damn. He's fucking doing the damn thing for being handcuffed. That's crazy. At least he got the front cuffs, dude. Normally, they don't give you that courtesy. That's a courtesy front cuff, fellas. Oh. Oh, god damn, I'm bleeding. I'm bleeding. Need to move along the car. The zombers couldn't get me. I, I'm supposed to not know that there's zombers, I suspect. Bro, get the shoddy. Get the shoddy. My boy, get the yeah, shoddy, boy. Yeah, okay. Would he have needed that? No, pick up the shotgun, bro. What the hell? Oh, come on. Come on now. Get on the fucking ground and pick that shit up. It's empty. It'll be bro. easier to carry with these cuffs off. Bro, pick up that shell. There ain't no fucking way, dog. Come on. Officer? 
Bro, he's God got to have damn. the fucking keys on him, right? Okay, I'm already scared, and this is a fucking telltale game. What the hell's going on here? Oh, hell yeah. Okay, get them goddamn keys off his ass. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my Shit. God. Wait, did it not work? Oh, my God. He's going to turn into a zomber. He's going to try to chomp at me, bro. He's going to chomp at me, bro. Unlock this shit right now, son. Oh my God. Okay. Okay. All right. We got that shit off boys. Okay. Okay. Get the fuck out of there. Get the fuck out of there, bro. Get the fuck out of there. He's officer. a officer. No fucking... Bro. Oh, what? You said no jump scares, shit. bro. What in the hell? Get the fucking shoddy, man! Get away from me! Put that shit in there! It's yo, are you? Yo, hey, yo! Don't make me do this! Oh! Bro, y'all said no jump scares? That was a fucking lie, I guess. That's crazy. No jump scares my ass, dude. Fuck. A cab. A cab. Wait, what Help! the hell? Go get someone! There, there's been a shooting! What do you mean there's been a shooting? You shot the fucking cop, bro. Brody said there's been a shooting. Ah! Bro, get the frick out of here, dude. Bro, at that point, adrenaline has to kick in. That's crazy. That's crazy. How does adrenaline... By the way, I lowered the audio. This is insane how loud the audio still is, despite me lowering it. At that point, adre adrenaline has to kick in, right? Like... Sorry, I, I was installing. Come on, man. Kaya isn't missing. I just let her ride. She's on the ground. She doesn't want to be on the bed no more. His leg hurts, Hossy. Bro, there's no fucking way where your leg, you're thinking about your leg in that situation, I feel like. Soil scientist, thank you for the five tier one gifted. Ah, offense. The natural, the natural enemy to zombies, bro. The one of the Jesuit soil science, science is sick as fuck. Hello? Anybody? Bro, what is... Oh my god, that's... Anybody's home. Yeah, fucking zombers, dude. That's who's home. But YOLO, I guess. I wonder if anybody's home. Hello? Anybody home? I need a little help. He is so cool, like Hello? all things considered, remarkably cool for the circumstances. He's just like, yo, I got a little bit of an injury. There's a cop that was killed. Very odd. I don't know how that happened. <laughs> Coming in. Don't shoot, okay? Dude, this is... <laughs> Black man walking into a home unannounced Hello? in Atlanta or in 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 Georgia in the state of Georgia in general. No zombie apocalypse is still a dangerous prospect. Okay. <laughs> Castle doctrine. This is a stand your ground state, my friend. What in tarnation do you think you're fucking doing out here? Bro, 
Bro, did the zombie apocalypse happen like weeks ago? What the hell? Jesus. Oh, come on, brother. Are you serious? Yo, he is so goofy. I'm going to die. How is he going to? We are not surviving this zombie apocalypse with this dude, bro. I swear to God. What's that beeping? What tested? Brother tested. Marshals. That's a Savannah area code. But that's the type of note you'd leave a babysitter. How did this house get so fucked up if the zombie apocalypse just happened? Am I asking too many questions right now? There are three new messages. This place has been ransacked. Just about anything worthwhile is gone. I, I will still look at every cabinet, okay? You never know, chat. You never know. Sometimes, sometimes the little rascals forget. Oh, that's probably bad water. Where the fuck is the message beep? No, we saw this already. Imagine if COVID had a 2% death rate instead of like 75%. If he slips and falls again, how am I, how am I supposed to bring up my inventory or whatever? Chat, what is the, how do I, how do I access the fucking thing? Oh. Hey, Sandra, this is Diana. We're still in Savannah. Uh, Ed had a little incident with some crazy guy near the hotel, so we had to get him back to the ER and have it checked out. Anyway, he's not feeling well enough to drive back tonight, so we're staying an extra day. Thanks so much for looking after Clementine, and I promise we'll be back in time before your spring break. Message 2, left at 11.19 p.m. Oh my god, finally. I don't know if you tried to reach us. All, all the calls are getting dropped. They're not letting us leave and aren't telling us anything about Atlanta. Please, please, just leave the city and take Clementine with you back to Murrieta. I've, I've got to get back to the hospital. Please let me know that you're safe. Uh-oh. Message 3, left at 6.51 a.m. Clementine, baby. If you can hear this, call the police. That's 911. We love you. We love you. We love you. Bro, what the fuck happened? How long was I out? Like, there's no way. This timeline doesn't make sense. Like, the guy was just, like, totally chill. Huh? Hello? You need to be quiet. Are you okay? I'm okay. They tried to get me, but I'm hiding until my parents come home. Bro, you are so cooked, kid. What's your name? I'm Clementine. This is my house. Hi, Clementine. I'm Lee. Where are your parents? They took a trip and left me with Sandra. They're in Savannah, I think. Where the boats are? Are you safe? I'm outside in my treehouse. They can't get in. That's smart. See? Can you see me? I can see you through the window. Aww. <laughs> Oh shit, bro. What the fuck do I do now? What the fuck do I do now? Oh, just this is spam Q? 
Oh, QTE is literally QNE. Oh my God, bro. Oh my God, bro. Fix the knee, bro. Get out of there. Fuck. Oh my God, Clementine, save my ass, Clementine. Clementine. Clementine, give me the motherfucking, give me the motherfucking hammer, bro. Oh my God, Clementine, give me the hammer. Give me the motherfucking hammer, Clement. Clemmy! Clemmy! Give me that motherfucking hammer, bro. Oh! Yes! Fuck you! Dumb fucking. Oh! Oh! Yeah! What's up? What's up? What's up? Get some stupid ass. Old stupid ass. Oh, you thought you could babysit? How about you babysit this dick? Let's go! Hi there. Sorry. Did you kill it? I don't know. I think so. Sometimes they come back. Have you killed one? No. <laughs> That's a weird lot. question to ask a baby. You've been all by yourself through this? Yeah. I want my parents to come home now. I think that might be a little while, you know? Oh. Look, I don't know what happened, but I'll look after you until then. What should we do now? Look for help before it gets dark. Get out of here once the sun goes down. Wait, what? No. Bro, we should look for help before it gets dark. I for I feel like that's number one rule in zombie shit is like zombies go extra hard at night. You know what I mean? Like night zombies are hungrier somehow. Who the fuck says let's wait for. We need to find help before it gets dark. Yeah, it's not safe at night. See, even the baby knows chatters are fucking L takers, bro. So, mm, go out, go out. To me. You should split up, yeah. Listen, as a black man, I am not splitting up in any circumstance in a horror movie situation, okay? Come on now. Are you kidding me? That's like rule number one of horror. Are those zombies or peoples? Oh man. Oh shit. I ain't never getting home to mama at this rate. This sucks. Oh, it's hot dish night. Oh hell yes. There's humans. Let's go. I wonder if they're going to be racist. Is there racism in the zombie apocalypse? What's no, that? right? There can't Should be. I stay? What? I don't want to sleep in the treehouse tonight, but I don't know if I should leave. What if my parents come home? I won't leave you alone. Well, let's go somewhere safe that's close, okay? That's a good idea. Hey, man! Holy shit! Don't eat us! We're not gonna hurt you. Yeah. Thought for a second you and the little one were both gonna give us the chump. We need help. Are you trying to get out of here? Because you should be. Those things are all over the damn place. I haven't seen anything as gnarly as this neighborhood since downtown Atlanta, 15 miles back. I'm Sean. Sean Green. Lee, this is Clementine. Racially motivated, by the way. I'm that Jeff. was crazy. That was crazy. They're like, oh, you see a black place. man? How you think I'm a zombie? I see how it is. You and your daughter out of here and down to my family's farm. It should be safer there. I'm not a dad. I'm... A neighbor. Her parents are out of town. Let's get going. Staying put for too long is a mistake. Sean, notice what you said? What do you want to do? I... Your monster's coming. You gotta go. 
Leave quick. Let's go. Bro, ain't no fucking way. What the hell? Why are we pushing the car, bro? Oh, there's a. Oh, because there's a fucking. The, the other car is in front of it. Okay, I see how it is now. Don't worry. Come on, bro. Give me the fucking prompt. Let's get the fuck out of here. <laughs> we put Where the fat man in the bike. Too? Is this a bad time to ask a political question? Unless it's about racial motivations in the zombie apocalypse, I am not. I am not trying to hear no political questions. I am not fielding political questions right now. Dude, this game is sick, by the way. Actually, like, not even a joke. This game is woke, too. Okay, bro. This is the most racist as ha bro. Bro, fuck out of here, bro. This is the mo. Oh, come on. This is a diabolical. This is a level orange threat, dude. Okay. This is like at this point, the zombies might be better, bro. You see those cornfields? You see those cornfields? You see that plantation as house? It's so Jover. There ain't no fucking way. Zombies at least indiscriminately kill every single human. These guys are specifically in the interest of killing black folk. Yeah, get out looking ass house. Oh my oh, god, nice. no Thank shot. He just <laughs> just went right into the plantation okay. home. Wait, is that a I cop? Was to be bad here too. Been quiet as usual the past couple days. Brecken down the way thinks his mare's gone lame, but that ain't nothing new. I wouldn't have made it back without Chet. Well, I'm glad you took him with you then. Even though he's a black man. Your boy's a lifesaver. Glad he could be a help to somebody. So it's just you and your daughter then? Oh, not his daughter. He was her neighbor. Honey, do you know this man? Oh my god! Yes. Okay, then. Thank gosh she lied, bro. Oh, my God. Imagine. You your leg pretty bad there. Uh, yeah. It's not doing so good. Okay, to be my fair, I don't know if that's racially motivated, to be honest, because, like, that is the appropriate thing for adults to do in that circumstance. I think I'm going to put myself in the top corner here. I feel like, is that a better place to put it? I've been looking at where I might put it. Um, I increased the volume, chat. I think that is the right appropriate thing to do in a in a situation like where you're an adult and you see a young girl with a dude who's like a random person. Oh, they will remember that is in the top. Okay, like maybe down here then. Cuz I feel like it covers a lot of the heads. help you out sean run on in and check on your sister you take a seat up on the porch and i'll go see what i have let's have a look yeah this is swollen to hell it's not too bad tough guy huh what did you say your name was? Doesn't matter, right? Oh, huh. shit. I... Well, if you're going to be here overnight, I'm going to need it. Unless you'd rather... Fuck! The I fucked it up. It's Lee. Well, Lee. Just Lee. I'll take it. I'm Herschel Green. I... I... I <sighs> pressed the wrong button. Car accident. That's so... 
Where were you headed before the car accident? Jail. I was getting out of Atlanta. The news says stay. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. We hit a guy. One of those things you've been hearing about. On the road. Who are you with, the girl? Nobody. Wait, is, is it we? So? Yeah, what? it is. You said we. That's all. Fuck! The house is full up with mine. We got I'm fucking up. I'm fucking up. I'm fucking up. The barn. You and your daughter are welcome to rest there when we're done here. I'm fucking up. I'm already lost. Ah, GG's. It's over. It's Clementine. over. He's gonna kill me. Clementine. <laughs> Can't imagine what you've been through, Clementine. I'm looking after her until we uh, find her parents. Hey, Dad. So I'm thinking, first thing tomorrow, we got to reinforce the fence around the farm. That doesn't seem necessary. I don't know what you saw on TV or heard on the radio, but there's some serious shit hitting the fan. I yeah, don't say think it quietly so Clem can't know. hear it. Your son's right. You're going to want to fortify this place. Stuff like that doesn't happen around here, Sean. Dad, I'm serious. <laughs> Bro, Please, he's so on. racist. Tell what you saw out there, man. I got chased by a couple of dead people. Well, do what you think you should. We got plenty of chores as it is. Oh my god, you fucking suck, dude. Can help out in the morning. We gotta do it. Really. I already said okay. Well, I'm all done here. It should start to feel better tomorrow. This right. is a classic small town racist chat. Chat, this is a classic small town racist, okay? Someone in the chat said this is a liberal by Georgia standards. I agree. Okay. Oh, that kind of stuff don't happen here. It happens in Atlanta where the blacks are. That type of shit, okay? Uh, yeah, we don't, we don't see color around these parts. Classic. He'll heal your leg if you come to his house. He will say the N-word behind closed doors, and he will shoot you, okay, if, he, if it reaches a certain level on a sus meter. If your leg gets hot or the swelling doesn't go down, you're probably dealing with an infection. What do we do then? We'll probably just have to shoot you. We'll clean it, redress it, and you'll be fine. Okay, that'd be preferable. There's blankets and such in the barn. We'll be seeing you bright and early. Come tomorrow, which way you think you're headed? Towards Macon, I suppose. Macon, huh? Good folk live out there around those parts, let me tell you. All right, then. Might not like your kind. <laughs> Don't you overextend it your welcome like here now. Manure. Manure? Like when a horse plops? Just like that. I miss my mom and dad. Someone said Meg is like 50% black. Yeah, 50% black, 50% racist. How far is Savannah? Pretty far. Oh, okay. Yeah, they he put them in the barn, bro. You know, you know what's up, okay? You know what it is. You know what's going on. Yeah, go sleep in the barn with them undesirables. <laughs> I love you, baby. That's where we keep the Mexicans. <laughs> that was before the zombie apocalypse. I'm talking about. <laughs> I'm talking recreationally. We used to do that. <laughs> Hey, get up. <laughs> I'm itchy. Well, you slept in a barn, little lady. Lucky you don't have spiders in your hair. <laughs> but I bet your daddy scared them all away, huh? I'm uh, not her dad. Name's Lee. I'm Kenny. Dad, we're in the middle of fence. There's a tractor and everything. Oh my you God, Toy going. Story looking ass hear kid. The end of it. That's my boy, Ken Jr. We call him Duck, though. Dodging or quacking? Quacking. Dad! See? The word is you were on your way to Macon. My family's from there. Well, Macon's on the way, and personally, I'd appreciate the company of a guy who can knock a couple of heads together if he has to. Bro, this guy looks racist, too. Sure, we'll tag along. It's a plan then. Honey, Duck, this is Lee. And uh, what's the girl's name? Clementine. Clementine. 
That is a very pretty name. Actually, Thanks. that's not true. Well, we should get. He's probably not racist because he's got the the puka shell necklace or whatever the fuck is called. That's a telltale sign that he's actually not. You know what I mean? You think you you want to think he is, but he's one of those dudes. He's just a swagged out white boy. To work. We've all seen what those things can do out there. So the faster we get this fence up, the better. I want to build a fence. Yeah. Well, I need a good foreman. You can sit on the tractor and yell at me whenever I take a water break. On the tractor? Cool! Duck and I will hop to it. I can keep an eye on your little girl here on the porch. We can visit. I can see Kenny having like a racially charged moment, but like, he doesn't mean it's it, you know what I mean? It's not the most reliable pickup in the world, but it gets the job done. Excuse me, that's a Toyota Tacoma, sir. Are you out of your fucking mind? That is the most reliable truck you can get in hey the there, market. Uh, Kenny? Need any help? No, I think I got it. Do you need any help? What do you mean? Well, I mean in taking care of that little girl. You know what you're doing? You got kids of your own? Damn, he clocked me. Nah. No, no kids. Would have liked one then. You know. How's your son doing? Good, I think. Kachi's got a sister up in Memphis. We were coming back from visiting her. We were in a gas station and some guy grabbed my boy. I thought he was kidnapping him. I was on the fucker in about two seconds and... Christ. Just lucky I was there. We saw a lot of bodies before we stumbled upon Herschel's. But we're a tough family, Lee. Ain't nothing gonna phase us. So what's your family's plan? Get back on down to Lauderdale and let this mess get sorted out. Oh no! The government will start handing out shots and the National Guard will do its thing. On the odd chance things got too bad, we could hop on my boat, I guess. Oh dude, he likes the government shots? Okay, that's my boy. He's based. He's a base Lauderdale man. That's a base Florida boy right there. He 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 not an anti-vaxxer, okay? Maybe this game actually predates that kind of thing. So <laughs> he's like, yeah, I love the government jab. I'll take it. I hope it makes me gay and autistic. Yes. You've got a boat. I'm a commercial fisherman, catching mackerel, dolphin, whatever's biting and paying. Katya wouldn't be wild about it, but the boat's not that bad. See you. Hey there, girls. You two actually look relaxed. I think we're doing just fine. Clementine was just telling me about first grade. Oh, is she uh, German? What's happening here? That? It's easy. Well, yeah. So you're good. Anyway, it's almost like we didn't see people eating each other for the past three days. It's peaceful here, no? She's Russian, huh? So, uh. What do you do when corpses aren't walking around? I'm a veterinarian back in Fort Lauderdale. Like Herschel here, except more with dogs and cats and uh, not horses. What is it that you do, Lee? I used to teach up at the University of Georgia. We need to hope that we can go back to our jobs soon, Lee. Back to normal. It can't stay like this. Uh, yeah, my mistake. We'll all be home soon. Bro, why why is he so voluntarily trying to tell everybody that he's like potentially a murderer? I don't know what the fuck he did. But he's like, I used to be a professor. I said I used to, as in I was in jail. I was on my way to go to prison. Like, what the fuck? What's wrong with him? How did you handle getting through the city? Kenny just drove. We passed so many people that needed help, and we just past people over some just just uh, it's okay it's fine you don't have to say anymore i want to go home tomorrow but even then i can't take away the things we the things doc went through don't you want to go back to the moment before you knew about all of this anybody in their right mind would families and barbecues and beers with good friends all of those things those are the things we live for, right? With those gone, what's the point? 
Okay, bro, Back you're fucking up the vibes okay. a little bit. Everybody's trying to have a good ass you time. A nice time with Katya Clementine. Yeah. He's just fucking up the vibes endlessly, bro. Oh yeah. What's the point of living? I want to die. It's like, bro, chill. People are trying to just live out here. You're like. What's up, Doug? That's it? You know how to drive it? Sure don't. I can give you a hell of a critique of the U.S. Farm Bill, though. I'm good. Oh, God. He's like, oh, God, he's a politics Sean's nerd. Shut up. Fence. Sean's still working on that fence. Do you uh, think this thing will keep him out? Not yet. I'm planning on coming back through on a fortification pass, if you will. We'll lock this place up good. Hey, Lee. Need a hand? That'd be great. If you could cut those two bites to length, that'd sure speed things up. QTE? QTE? My dad doesn't know how bad it is. No, he doesn't. I saw a guy in Atlanta kill a kid. A boy. Just shot him right in the face. You gotta do what you can to survive. Like put a gun to that kid's head and pull the trigger? Fuck that, man. He didn't even hesitate. He just turned, put the barrel of the gun right between the kid's eyes. I'm fucking bad, bitch. I'm a bad trigger. bitch. I've decided. You don't see things like that. It's not like in the movies. They don't fall like you think. Did you have to do it? Do what? Kill. Have you had to off one yet? Oh. Uh... Bastard, poor girl's brains in. Whoa, uh, I couldn't do that. I'm just. I didn't want to say I killed a cop. Dad just wants to keep the family safe and thanks I feel like people. I feel like admitting that I killed a cop is gonna be like too, too, too much. You know what I mean? Like, I, I'm still suspicious that these guys are racist. Okay. Is a bigger threat than whatever's out there. How about yours? How's your family? My brother and parents are in Macon. I hope. Oh man, I hope so too. Maybe it's not too bad there. That's probably all I need cut for now. Thanks. And Sean, thanks again for the ride. No problem, Lee. Couldn't leave you behind. Anyway, when you see my dad around, he might want some help in the barn. Bro, I am not trying to hang out with that man. Okay, let me tell you. I'm gonna talk to Doug instead. Doing, Doug? Good. I'm gonna drive the tractor. I'm the foreman. Lift with your back, Sean. Hey, Doug's a bit of a dumbass. Product of American education right there. What's up, Herschel? You should know that if you weren't leaving with Kenny today. I wouldn't stand for your lack of honesty last night. I'm not sure I follow. A man asks you your name, you give it. Unless that name is no good. God damn! How'd you get out of Atlanta? Oh, shit! I got a ride and then I was in a wreck. I walked until your boy found me. Hmm. Well, you're no worse for wear. Uh, this farm's a nice plot of land. Huh. <laughs> Had you told me 20 years ago I'd still be doing this, I would have told you that you were full of crap. Never was a plan, having a place like this. It was in the family, and I guess so was I. I'm sorry. Family's important. It's all that matters. You agree with that? Was brought up to, yes. Where's your family now? Parents? Wife? Girlfriend? No wife anymore? Why? Bro! Why would you even have that as an option? I almost clicked on it. It's so stupid. It's like I almost misclicked and said I have no wife no more. Like, bro, I need to stop clicking, I think. I don't know.
It's just like... Brother. Well, I hope they're all right. But now you've got this little girl to take care of. Clementine, is it? You just stumbled up on her? Yeah. I was looking for help in her house. Hmm. Can I give you a piece of advice? Sure. I don't know who you are or what you did. Let's say things don't get better back in the cities, or they get worse before they do. You're gonna have to depend on the honesty of strangers if you're gonna make it. And if those same people get to questioning yours, you're gonna be in trouble. He's right. He's so racist, but he's right. Common sense to listen to a man giving you advice. Go! I'll get my gun! What's happening? Uh oh. Bro. My dude. Oh my god. He's fucking. That is the shittiest wall of all time, bro. My leg is. I gotta save Duck. Oh fuck, they're gonna eat his ass. Oh, they literally eat his ass, bro. <laughs> Did I fuck up? Should I have gone for Sean first? Kenny ran away because like, I mean, that, that's his boy. You know what I mean? Like that makes sense. Bro, that's literally your fault. You said no to the you said sorry. no to the wall. Your son is alive. You don't get to be sorry. And you, you didn't even try to help. I was worried about the boy. But you weren't worried about that. Please. Just go. Get out and never come back. Yeah, I want to build a border wall. Hell yeah, brother. That's why I voted Trump. Bro, you want to know what I did there? I'm going to be honest with you. I knew I was fucking getting the fuck out of there. And the dude's son was fine, but the dad was racist. I was like, all right, fuck this. Fuck this dude with a racist dad. I'm putting my eggs in the basket that I'm going to be driving in. Okay. The dude who fucking owns a Toyota Tacoma. The Fort Lauderdaleian who is a uh, pro vaccination. I'm going with that guy. Okay, sorry. It's called survival, bitch. You've got that ride to make it if you want it. Bro, how are you gonna give me grief? I saved your stupid ass fucking son. Old dumbass that fucking got him trapped with the tractor. Old dumbass that fucking killed him. Dumbass duck. Well, this is as far as we're going. Bye, Herschel, with your dead ass son. Bro, don't signal Trunks to the. Out of gas. That's a zomber, bro. Are you fucking stupid? Fuck. I mean, yeah, they are stupid. We're trapped. <laughs> oh my god, old oh, bum over here, fucking duck. Run. What is that posture? He 
These guys hate gates. They hate fences. Walls work, baby. Walls work. I say that door stays shut no matter what. I fucking mean it. We don't know who these people are. It could be dangerous. Worse, they could have let them right to us. Where the hell is your humanity? We have kids with us. I see one little girl. What is it? I, I have to pee. I'd go out there again in a second. I bet you would. Then just go. Wait, why am I yelling? They've got kids, Lily. Those things outside don't care. Maybe you uh -oh. should go join him then. You'll have something in common. God damn it, Lily. You have to control these people. Carly and Glenn just ran out there. She's not wrong. They took a risk. Yes, we did. And we appreciate it. Now let's settle down. Holy shit. Son of a bitch. One of them is bitten. He wasn't bitten. Hell, he wasn't. We have to end this now. Over my dead body, we'll dig one hole. No, I'm cleaning him up. There's no bite. He's fine. Don't you fucking people get it? We've already seen this happen. We let someone with a bite stay in, and we all end up bitten. Shut up. We gotta throw him out, or smash his head in. Kenny, <laughs> stop him! Hey, what do we do about this guy? Dad, it's just a boy. It, it's... Lily, I'll handle this. But your heart, Dad. You need to calm down. We reason with him. With the bloody end of an axe handle, maybe. Nobody threatens my boy. Everyone chill the fuck out! Nobody is doing anything. Shut up, Lily. And you, shut the fuck up. They will find us, and they will get in here. I don't like and his none of this subtitles. fucking matter. Bro, his subtitles are red? I don't like that, okay? I don't like that one bit. Let me tell you. Let me tell you, is is villainous, okay? He's giving villain vibes. With the words he's saying, and also even the subtitles are red. I don't know. Right now, we're about to be trapped in here with one of those things. What the hell are you talking about? <sighs> he's bitten. That's how you turn. He's not bitten. Please stop this. It's upsetting him. Oh, I'm upsetting him. Upsetting is getting eaten alive. What if this was your daughter? Never would have happened. She's not <laughs> some snot-nosed toddler, okay? She's United States Air Force. Fuck you and her. <laughs> I'm gonna kill him, Cat. Just worry about Duck. Lee! Yeah? There's someone in there. It's just locked. Key's behind the counter. Probably. Wait, what? Hey, There's... I'm not the bad guy here. I'm just looking Wait, out what's for in my there, dog. bro? What's no, in there? just the guy arguing for killing a kid. He's covered in muck. She'll find the bite. Watch! She won't. And if she does... First thing he'll do is sink his teeth into his mom's face. Then, when she's dead, he'll probably pounce on your little girl. It's a little boy. I think we can handle it. A little boy? He'll be an uncontrollable man-eater. It's not gonna happen. It is. And we're tossing him out now! Knock this guy out. Happily. Jesus! Oh, oh man. Oh, he got owned. Oh, shit. I didn't know he had hands like that. Oh, summer time. Oh, God, I suck so bad. I'm such a fucking L nerd, dude. Get away from her, you son of a bitch. I'm such a freaking L nerd, bro. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. It's not working. It's not working. Oh, I almost died. I almost died. Thank God they saved me. The QTE is so much harder on keyboard. It's not even a joke. You okay? Just great, thanks. Bro, I bring nothing to the table. Guys? Everybody down. I bring nothing to the table. I'm falling around. I'm back in the wrong guys. They're gonna get in. Shut up. Are they eating the walls? What the fuck? Is that the military? I don't know. Thank God for whatever it is. We almost died because of this bitch and a Richie trigger finger. That was stupid. That was. Uh, uh, Dad! Ah! Oh. Ah! oh my God. God took care of it. Was he the one bitten? <laughs> no, don't be crazy. It's his heart. 
My pills. Um, nitroglycerin pills? Yes, we're out. We've been trying to get into the Oh, I'm not finding those fucking here. pills, let me tell you. Please try to get in there. Oh, Behind the counter oh, where the oh, 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 you want me to save that fucking asshole? Uh, excuse me. Ain't no fucking way. There's probably another entrance. Maybe through the office. How do you know that's an office? Uh, educated guess. It doesn't matter. We need nitroglycerin pills. Please get in there. I'll keep an eye on my dad. Everyone else should get comfy and look for anything useful. We could be in here a while. I'm starting to think this drugstore isn't a permanent solution. You're right. This ain't exactly Fort Knox. What do you suggest? We need as much gas as possible so we can all get out of downtown Macon. Fast. Agreed. And I'll head out and get gas. There's a motel not too far from here, out towards the end of Peachtree. I'll work my way towards it and then loop back, siphoning what I can. You're insane. Well, it's got to get done. Plus, I'm quick. insanely cool. I don't make it. Local, born and raised. If you're gonna do that, here's a walkie-talkie. If you get in a tight spot, hopefully, you won't need it. Cool. Clementine's got the other one. Check in with her and get back here as soon as you can. Yeah, you, here. What's your name? It's. Here's a walkie-talkie. On the other end, a baby. Okay. There you go. I will give you a walkie-talkie so you can talk to a fucking child. Lily, my dad's Larry. Keep a good eye on him. These boys will work on getting you your medicine. That's right. And you, you keep an eye on that front door. You're our lookout. It's Doug. You got it. And I'm Carly. Okay, Carly. You'll shift in with Doug when he needs it. For now, get some rest. You're a good shot. And I'd like to keep it that way. You got it, boss. Now get Why is he boss? Pills. Bro, we just dramatically restructured the fucking hierarchy here like dramatically you're a pretty good shot damn well, riz don't fuck with a reporter, riz. especially one that's three days out from her last cup of coffee you seem to handle yourself pretty well <laughs> really i'm a disaster i can't tell my news editor was eaten about five feet away from me and I would have joined her if it wasn't for that dorky guy on watch over there. I'm sorry. She was an asshole, but, you know. Yeah. Damn. What are you messing around with there? A radio. I can't get it to work, though. Here, let me have a look. Let a man do it. A man's gotta do what a man does. All right, first, let's take a look. Well, the there's your problem. What now? Do you know that there are no batteries in that thing? Yeah, of course. I, I mean, yeah. No. I can try to find some. Needs two. Thanks. I wouldn't even really know what to look for. A man's got to do what a man does. Heard or seen anything? Nothing, luckily. Wanna step outside, have a look around? <laughs> I'm not suicidal yet. No, the gate out there is closed. We can hang out in front of the store and be fine. Oh, huh. Uh, not right now. All right, let me know if you want to. He needed that W? I really did. No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards. Black owned business. Joe Brandon's America destroyed this dude. I don't even know what I just picked up. Oh, batteries. Can't okay. let anything happen to Ducky. I know, hon. Oh, good. These newspaper clippings, I can totally I read them. them very well. Wait, wait, this is my family. I don't remember them. We just need Wait, to get what? back to Fort Lauderdale. We'll do our damnedest. Hey, Lee. Maybe punching him wasn't such a good idea. There were worse plans. Says the guy who didn't get punched in the mouth. Anyway, we, Kat and I, appreciate your support. Thank you, Lee. So that's how he knew it was an office, bro. 
Context clues. I'm so smart. How's Duck doing? He's okay. It was just a shock. We're lucky as hell nobody got nabbed on the way in here. Little kid. How's she doing? Well, her family's dead, so... That's awful, Lee. <laughs> yeah, well... She seems to be handling herself all right. She's just a little girl, Ken. Lee <laughs> says she spent days on her own. <laughs> That's such that a dumb... Toughness. But I chose that on no my own too, all on my emotional own. Emotional damage is happening to her every second her family is gone. Why can't I click on this shit? Plan? Hang tight, I suppose. Seems pretty dangerous out there, so we ought to wait for things to clear up. You said your family was from here in Macon? That's right. Yeah, that Where that, are they? that choice 100% that her well her family's dead so is 100% something i would say in in similar circumstances so i had to hit that okay i had to hit that like the top of the hour ad break has to hit you if you're not subscribed to the top of the hour i hate to do it to you but you know at the top of the hour there is a 3 minute ad break folks and if you no longer want to see those ads all you need to do is subscribe for five dollars or for free with a Twitch Prime, baby. By connecting your Amazon Prime account to your Twitch account, you get one free Prime subscription a month. Here's the three minute break now. Hell yeah! Raise hell, praise Dale, brothers. That's how it be. Can you boost dialogue volume? Is it low still? I'll boost it once because this fucking the audio is on steroids, son. Actually. Hey, Adrian is online. Thank you for the 5 2 one gifted subs. I've noticed there's more gifted subbers out here. Gamers got deeper pockets than the fucking dirty socialists. They uh, own this place. They're gone. Oh, sweetie. Cat. They were good people. I wasn't around much, but yeah, they're dead. Are you guys all right? Oh, we're just fine, considering. Maddie Coes, thank you. DC Baller, thank you. We've all been through a lot. Lee, you got a second? Sure. I, I did the big reveal. I told him. Back on Herschel's farm. Is socialism yeah. or barbarism? Anonymous gifter. We didn't even try to save him. Ty Yob, Marco that Flea. That blood is on our hands, you know? It happened pretty fast, I guess. But I can't stop seeing him in my head. We can't kill ourselves. Over we him. killed that I boy. Think of the ten. We could have saved him together. We did what we could. Bad things happen. We didn't make a choice that killed Sean. Your you dumbass you son you did, though. Your dumbass moment, son did. When Duck things did. Are really out of control. You don't have any choice. I guess. Thank you, damn it, Daifuku. Trying to let it go. Your dumbass son was fucking playing choo choo on the goddamn tractor and he fucking chewed the other dude's ass before the zombies killed him. So, who's at fault? Who could really say? Maybe you're a bad dad and you fucked it up. I'm taking all the energy bars, bro. This is my fucking pharmacy anyway. You know what I mean? At first, I was like. Maybe I should leave it for some other people too, but fuck it. This is my goddamn house, dude. Fuck you. It's not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. <laughs> yeah, the ATM. That'll Looks definitely. Like nobody got a chance to donate anything before this all went down. Central High Tech State. Papers a week old. Feels like years. Hey there. Hi. Any word from Glenn? Nothing. Is he okay? Yeah, I think so. You're doing a good job. 
Can I, uh, get you anything? I'm okay. Maybe I'm a little hungry. I'll see about that. So, um... Are you okay? What? Uh, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. I just, uh... I'm good. That's good. Yeah, I think so. Uh, being good is good. Despite the circumstances. What the fuck? Yep. We'll sit tight. Okay. Honestly, the dialogue is pretty good. I know it's like a meme to say it right there. now. But it is actually pretty good. This is a fucking I'm great I'm not sure I story. Got name. It's Lee. Lily. My dad's Larry. I was just doing what I had to earlier. Everyone was. Now his heart's acting up again and I'm powerless to do anything. And that violence before with my dad, that didn't help. What's wrong with him? He's got a heart condition. He takes nitroglycerin tablets pretty regularly. I've seen a few bad attacks that he couldn't get over and needed to go to the hospital. Yeah, that's uh, not really an option right now. I'm just trying to keep him relaxed. <laughs> He's got a temper. Ah, oh, <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> yeah, he doesn't mean it. It's just that... Yeah, just like yeah. the racism. We've got kids here. Families. He and I are a family. I'm just saying some people can't handle a temper like that. Hell, barely seems like you can. It's just his way. Don't make him the reason everything's screwed. Oh my god, they both suck. Where's Damn. her mom? They both have an so attitude bad, problem. I think. Oh, you guys aren't together. Oh, uh, no, I'm not her dad. I found her in a house when getting out of Atlanta. She'd been surviving by herself. I think the girl's parents didn't make it. Oh. I heard an answering message. They were in Savannah. She was home with a sitter. It wasn't good. Well, she's lucky to have you. You're from here? I work at Warner Robins, the Air Force base. Yeah, I know it. Pilot? Nah, just mechanical admin stuff. I deal with a bunch of shitheads and bureaucrats all day. Sometimes a plane, if I'm lucky. You? I work up at UGA. Was anyone here when you guys got here? No, this place was pretty wrecked. We pulled a couple of bodies out of the office. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Did you know anybody here? Yeah, the owners, they were, uh, we were close. I'm sorry. We found an older couple in the office. Dad hauled them out in case they weren't really dead. What do you think about all this? What is there to think? <laughs> Larry dead are killed up walking them. around, eating people, and turning them into more... more of them. I mean, Jesus. We need to stick together and get through this. I'm gonna get back to him. Sounds good. I'm letting Larry die, bro. Straight up. No shot am I keeping that fucker alive, bro. He killed my family. Racially motivated, 100%. He 100 OP saw a black couple thriving in their fucking family-owned small business pharmacy and was like, I hate that. I'm a racist. I bet that's what it's he said, much, too. But here you go. Thank you. Of course. Fuck you, Larry. Fucking bitch. That's crazy to me. Some some a bitch. Try to get some rest, hun. How can I with those things out there? All right, where the fuck is the the sexy ass journalist chick here? This battery should fit the radio. Great. There you go. Thanks. And here's another one. I'm gonna fucking rizz her up. Get even. It to work now. Damn, I got not one but two batteries. You know what I'm saying? It's still not working. Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. Let, let a man handle it. Go ahead. Let a man handle it, you know what I'm saying? He's gonna be like, the batteries were put wrong. I swear to God, bro. Bro, she did. She put the fucking batteries wrong, bro. Are you for fucking real? I was just joking, dude.
Bro, how do you not know how to fucking? That's crazy to me. You fixed it. Bro, that's what, dude. Come on. Okay, that's like that's gotta be misogynistic. That's crazy. That's crazy, dude. Bro, she put the batteries in wrong. That's like military, by the way. No, she's not military. The other girl is military. This girl is a journalist. Skyrocket. WABE urges you to stay indoors and avoid any contact with individuals you suspect may have been exposed. The station is okay. In the event of a full... Uh, uh, my, my producer's telling me we have to get off the air. Steve... Wow, that happened right at that moment. That's crazy. Hey, Carly. That guy saved you? Yeah, can you believe it? Those creeps or, or ghouls or whatever the hell they are. They were pulling our van apart and that guy, Doug, just came to the rescue. You can never tell who the heroic ones are gonna be, I suppose. He's kind of cute. In that parent's basement what? sort of Yo, way. chill! Oh. Yo, he sucks. Huh? Uh, nothing. He sucks. Are you okay? The video sign-off didn't sound too good. Are you okay? I'm fine. You don't have to be. It's traumatic. I'm sure some people got out. Maybe they're all being rescued. Then again, maybe not. Bro, I'm literally taking care of a child. Do you know? Think about how sexy that is, okay? Really re-examine your priorities. I was about to give you a fucking snack bar, too. Guess what? Maybe I'll give it to Doug so he can get his fucking stamina back laying pipe. You know what I'm saying? God damn it, dude. I got you two batteries and shit. What the fuck? Doug's not even doing nothing. He's just macking. Bro, the sign literally said alive inside. You went in there and you killed them, Larry. You fucking piece of shit. You goddamn monster. I fucking hate Larry, dude. All my homies hate Larry. Larry definitely marked them. Aid kit. 1 hundred percent Larry marked them. Dads came in here hoping to survive. But it looks like one of them was hurt. I wonder if it was my dad. <sighs> Trying to be a hero, maybe. Or a protector at least. There's a photo over there. There's a photo over there. Look at the photo, bro. <gasps> it's a family photo. Okay, Larry, 100% racially motivated. What? Find anything? Just a picture of whoever was here. I know who you are. You're Lee what? Everett. You're a professor at Athens who killed a state senator who was sleeping with your wife. This is your parents' store. Folks around town know the owner's son got himself a life sentence, but I'm a reporter for WABE in Atlanta. Damn, that's why she... to that trial. Maybe you're a murderer. Damn, bro. That's why she was like, I want to fuck Doug. I, I'm sorry. Excuse me. I, you can't riz me up. But I don't really care. Frankly, that's a skill that might come in handy. <laughs> Did you tell anyone out there who you were or that you were tied to this place? What's it to you? To me? I'm not the one with the felony record. You seem like an okay guy, and the last thing we need is drama out there. You've got this little girl to take care of, and look, don't make me wrong on this. I don't plan to. Good, because if this lasts longer than a few days, and you're a detriment to the group, then we'd have a problem. I hear you. 
I'll just keep it to myself. Bro, what's a felony? There is no fucking, there's no criminal justice right now. Innocent until proven guilty, bitch. How can I trust you? You can't, I suppose. But you don't have many other options. Yeah, give me those goddamn batteries back. Asshole. She's been the racist one the whole time. I know. Buzzfeed quiz, Buzzfeed quiz writing ass. That's Kane. Dumbass. He'd zip around here on it from time to time. Was he sick? Nah, he was okay. I actually saw him whoop shoplifters with it. <laughs> this Kane's protected this place better than any guard dog ever could. Plus, he knew how to make it look cool, like you and your hat. My dad gave it to me. See, your dad's just smart like that. I ought to clear a path to opening that door. We ought to clear this door for when we find the keys. Better get this door clear, huh? Can I help? Sure. Here we go. Watch your fingers in the drawers. <sighs> How are you doing? Yeah, it's not that heavy. How about with everything outside? It's not good. No, it's not. But I think it'll be okay. Okay, here we go. <sighs> Damn, Clem is actually goaded. Do you have kids? She's playing her part. No. You don't have a family? She's not asking no dumb questions about how I'm a murderer. What do your parents do? My mom is a doctor, and my dad is an engineer. Those are good jobs. What's your job? I, uh, teach history and writing and things like that. Like, um, social studies? Yeah, like that. You didn't answer my question. All right, a little further. <sighs> Why don't you want to talk about your family? Do they, like, hate you? Because they're dead. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. You didn't know. I'm just sorry for being mean. It's like, that shut her the fuck up, you know what I mean? It's like, shut the fuck up, Clementine. I like you, but, like, you're pushing it right now, okay? Look, my family's gone, and I just wish things would have been different. Yeah. I got into some trouble, and, and I didn't talk to them for a while. This used to be their store. But let's just keep that between you and me, okay? Okay. Because of the trouble? Yeah, that's right. Now, uh, let's get this done. Bro, the fact that there is a fucking dialogue option to tell a literal baby that I am a ruthless murderer is savage. Like, what, it, what it, why does that dialogue option exist? Yeah, I fucking murked somebody, okay, Clementine? I'm a fucking straight-up murderer, dog. You don't understand, okay? I fucking, it, I, I kill people I've killed, and I want to kill again, okay? Let me tell you. Every time I'm not killing a zombie, I want to kill humans, as a matter of fact. Damn, she's bleeding a lot. Is it bleeding? A little. I'll find you a bandage. She's fucking That's hemorrhaging, bro. There, I bet. Oh, good. Let me open this drawer first. the remote for that thing in here someplace. Lee? Yeah? What if my parents come home and I'm not there? 
they'll uh, try to I don't to think help. they will. Don't worry. Yeah, okay. Well, we should keep a lookout. I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Stay close to me until then, okay? Does she think the walkie-talkie is going to work have a look in miles away and make it? No. It hurt. Let's see if we can do something about it. We gave the fucking walkie-talkie to Glenn. Let's get this cut covered up. Yes, please. Dumbass. Dumb baby. <laughs> Leave that dumbass baby alone. It's the remote to my dad's TV. Turn that shit on, bro. Let's see if we got any TV channels on here. That's what I figured. You never know, bro. You never know. You got to check it out. It's locked. We need to track down the keys if we're going to help Larry. Who are you talking to? My boy. Everyone out there seem all right to you? Yeah. Well, maybe not the sick guy. Yeah. We'll keep an eye on him. There was that thing in the bathroom. It tried to get me. I know. But you stopped it. Yeah, I did. Barely. Can no, I didn't. Can you do that more? Well, I'm not going to go looking for him. I mean, get the dangerous ones. I'm gonna try. Good. Have you heard from Glenn? Not in a little while. How's your finger? It's okay. Thanks for fixing it. I'm gonna keep looking around. Okay. Yeah, y'all yeeted that first time chatter. He was cooking, I think. Wait, how do you examine the bedding? Like, I'm trying to find... That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. Where are the fucking keys at, dude? Doesn't seem like he's in this room. Back into the drugstore with me. Okay. Lee? Yeah? You're not bad, right? I, uh, why are you asking me that? That lady said you killed someone. Was that because he was one of the things trying to eat you? It's complicated. Sometimes things happen or you do things and you can't explain them. I don't want to lie to her. Let's, uh, I'm talking to her to about the, the morality of murder. Hey there. Uh, this is Glenn, and uh, I'm kind of in a jam here. Uh, little girl, if you're there, can you put your daddy on the phone? Or on the talkie or whatever? This is Lee. What's up? So, I'm down at that motor inn, and... Well, uh, I'm stuck. Stuck? Yeah, I uh, saw a chance to get some supplies for the group, and a bunch of the Roman ones got the jump on me. I'm hiding over here, but they won't leave. What's up? Glenn's trapped down at the motor inn. Hey, Glenn, we're gonna talk it over and send a group to come get you, all right? <sighs> awesome. I'll sit tight till then. Sounds good. I'm gonna hold on to this until we get Glenn back, okay? I'll take good care of it. What do you think? I think Doug's not great around zombies. And you got your family here. I'll take Carly and her dead eye down to the motor inn, get Glenn, and get back here as fast as I can. If that's what you want to do, somebody's got to. Yeah, I'm in. Good. Doesn't sound too bad there right now. Let me know as soon as you want to head out. I could use yeah, a Yeah, bro. Job. 
I'm taking I'm taking Carly down there to kill her because she knows my secret, dude. That's right. You already know what the fuck's going on there. That or maybe if she's like, oh yeah, I was just kidding. I actually love a fucking rugged murderer sexo. You know what I mean? How we doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Let's have a look around. Okay. Sexo. I'm actually gonna feed Doug to the fucking zombies. Jesus. And then we're gonna do sexo. Eat. As far as I can tell, that's all they care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, Who was shooting at them before? I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. Use the Ramona. It's a combination lock. Open the lock? What the fuck? That place is full of TVs and electronics. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Man, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. <laughs> Look at the one trapped over there. Oh, that's Better his brother. Us, huh? That's definitely his brother. That's one Hundo P his brother. Oh shit. What? Do you know that guy? He could be a drugstore employee. So you're saying he might have the pharmacy keys? I'm saying he might have the pharmacy keys. I don't know. It could be anybody, you know. If they start rotting and get all chewed up and... Shut up, dog. Look at the uniform, though. He could have worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. I'll see what I can find. What the fuck do you mean, bro? Use the remote. Give the remote to Doug. I have the photo, bro. We should think about searching that guy across the street. Maybe he has them, but who knows if he actually worked here. How do I give him the fucking... How do I change my... How, how do I change the inventory? It's like on TV remote. Uh, how do I grab the? No, I have the photo on me. You can uh, you can see it. I, I just don't know how to give the photo to. I can't reach that brick. That guy over there has the keys. How can oh. you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy in the photo worked here. The keys being on him is as good a bet as we could make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. Bro, Good Chad deal. is so racist. Chad is so racist, bro. He said, you dropped this part of the photo when you ripped it. How are you going to be racist to literally the main character and his brother, bro? How is that possible? No, the part of the photo that I ripped off was me. I ripped myself from the family photo. <laughs> I'm just kidding. A Mormon in heart heat. It was a mistake. Switch the controller. It plays so much better. Yeah, oh, I man. think so too, but it's fine. I'm playing with this right now. Maybe 
maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. Maybe the remote works on this thing? Think you can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? He's gonna throw it. It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Damn, Doug, you fucking so nerd. Good on. shit. You can just do that? My Some kind of hacker. AV. Let's try. Well fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? I got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. What the hell? I can't reach that brick. Not that far, bro. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. There should be a skip. Doug, you want to get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? No. Did anyone ever have it? Look, man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. We're also party to some egregious fire code violations. Bro, you are an unconscionable nerd. I swear to God, Doug. How'd you end up here? Well, I moved here to live with my uncle. He does tech stuff and it just made sense. Wait, how so the fuck local, did Glenn get out then? I knew the owners of this place. No, not really. I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time. On the computer? No, just doing my own thing what about you i grew up here been trying to get home since the day I came back oh so you probably knew the owners then yeah i did good people Okay, so we're fucking cooked out here. Like, there's not really any. There's not. Let's head back inside. Okay. Bro, we can't search the guy. We need to find the code to unlock the gate. Oh, Doug is the IT guy from on that list, bro. Hey there. I better get back to it. Yep. Thanks, by the way. Don't mention it. Just remember what I said. Yeah, I will. Talk to Carly. No, that's Lily. Who the fuck is Carly? It's all melted now. How are we doing? If you don't mind, I think my family and I are gonna rest for a bit. Alabastrian, well, thank you for the five tour and give the subs. Worse. You got it. Man, he shut my shit down. He was like, nope. How'd you end up here? We drove oh, off to shit, cover the golden cabin train. Let's go. Real hard hitting stuff. Sounds worth it. I better get back to it. Yep. Thanks, by the way. Don't mention it. 
Just remember what I said. Yeah, I will. Golden Kappa train. Is there a way to get into the bathroom? No. All right, I got to get back into the fucking pharmacy part. Maybe there's some more shit that I missed there. I don't really understand. Like, I feel like I did a thorough... I feel like I did a thorough search. You know what I mean? Why can't I grab the cane? Uh, the keys are on that zombie out on the street. I can't get the cane, chat. I, it's not letting me. There's not an option. I'll go back into the first aid kit again. Luckily, but there's nothing I need in here. Post life. Thank you for the tank gifted. King Henry the fourth. Thank you for the twenty gifted. We're at fucking level four. It's crazy. My streamer is dumb as fuck. No, I think I can't do anything further here to progress. I just, I, I need hey. to go get Glenn before we continue, I think. I'm gonna get back to him. Trinrec, thank you for the five, get the subs. Remote on, remote on the TV, babe. Babe, babe, I already tried that, babe. Okay, here, I'm gonna pee real quick too. Babe. Thank you, the big sod, and I'm, I'm sorry in Girth Burgers and Lesbian Boulevard. Chest, stop coming. Thank you, Daniel Art. I think I need to leave. We're leaving now. That's what we're doing. We're done. We're leaving. I've exhausted all the options here. Pretty sure. Bolivar. You ready to head out? You got it. You? Search the bed, Poppy. I did, bro. I did. Yeah. Let's go. No way. Did you see that? I sure did. Be ready to shoot. Guys! Oh man, I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn! That wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trapped up there. No way. We gotta go now. Listen, I was out here looking for gas, and then up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her, and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A couple almost got me, and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. 
You guys are suicidal over a girl. I'm saving her with or without you. Think about wow, it. Wow, she's you. just jealous. She wants to be the eight girl, bro. It's obvious. Right, let's go save Glenn's dance. It's obvious. Wow. She's like, oh, only me. Only I get to fucking be the girl here. Oh, me, 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 me. It's fucked up. Honestly. Wait, what am I? What am I looking at over here? Where am I? So we have to kill every one of them in here. Quietly. Noise attracts these things. Now let's have a look around. Oh man. She's eating something. So we got that one right there. Close. We can hide by that RV. If we're quiet and keep our heads down. We can hide by that pickup. Who's behind that door? Those two seem to be on the scent. Fuck. Oh my god. I don't fucking know, dude. I don't know. Should I go behind the RV? I feel like there's hella way more zombies there. I think we go with the truck. Shit happens. I don't think you can save scum in this game. In that fucking door a window that's crazy open the door bro oh of course it's locked that's cool that's cool of course it's locked why wouldn't it be bro i am not punching that thing are you crazy wait up and the right goes in the same direction okay Oh, he's alive? What the fuck? Barely. Barely alive. Bro, I don't want to break it. But I feel like I got no other option. How are you going to kill that one by the car without attracting the others? I have to break it. Ow. Hey man, that drew some attention. Be careful. That's crazy. Do I try again? I'm done trying to punch out windows. Wait, what am I doing here? Fuck, bro. We're a little naked out here, except for Carly's gone, and we can't use that much. <laughs> I'm not sure I can take them both out myself, even if I had a weapon. Fuck. Wait, I'm fucking cooked. We're going to need weapons. What the fuck am I supposed to do? 
there's this there's no option here like I, i've looked through the whole Yeah, I can't break through the truck, chat. takes me to the window again that's it like right when I hit right no up also takes me to the fucking window chat you guys are wrong okay this is fucking annoying he's not going anywhere Grab pillow? Where the fuck's the pillow? There's no pillow. This level is confusing if I... Pillow is by the wall? I don't see no goddamn pillow, bro. What do you mean, pillow? Michael pillow ass. There's nothing here. right there bottom right on the ground it's on the floor what are you talking about where that bro it's not letting me get it oh my god there's a pillow over there that's about as far as i got when it came to supply guy i might have an idea for it that's crazy that that is just like good luck smothering them to death that's not really what i have in mind I can break the fucking window now with the pillow. God damn, that shit was hard as fuck, dog. Oh my god. Stop saying astigmatism, Andy, okay? The solar eclipse fucked me up. What are you gonna do with that? Do you have any tricks for getting into cars? Not without tools or making a bunch of noise, and none with pillows. Use the fucking pillow on the window to break it, bro. What do you mean? I'm done trying to punch out windows. Wait, that's. Oh my god, I'm so annoyed. Maybe I can fucking smother that zombie. Get out your gun. But the noise. Just follow my lead. Stay right behind me. Wow. That was sick. The pillow really softened the, the noise. Famously, pillows do that. Park plug. We take those. Never know. Unlock gear shift, put that shit in neutral. Spark plug. You should hold on to that. Could come in handy. We can get that guy by the wall over there, I bet. We can hide by that pickup. Oh, 
Okay, both of those angles do the same thing. All right, I got to push it, I guess. Awesome. Okay, well, I'm out in the fucking open now. How can I use a spark plug to break this shit? Let me see the spark plug. The porcelain inside these things turns car windows to tissue paper. Scramble a brain pretty good. That's exactly what I was thinking. Real, I was the window. Y'all are dumb as hell, bro. His head, bro. Dumbass. Oh, fuck. One more. Lee, Let's go. Get him. Easy peasy, baby. Nice. Thanks, Easy man. fucking peasy. Sure. Dude, that shit is nothing to me, dude. I'm the zombie murker, dude. Grab that shit. Grab that shit and fuck him up. Okay, spark plug his ass. Yeah, easy fucking easy, bro. Dude, where'd your weapon go? Into that ice big sized hole. <laughs> Holy shit. It's cool. Now we've got this. Are you two done? Upgrade. 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 Door. Big time. That should help. Is there anything else over here that we can use? No. Why don't you guys lag behind just in case this goes to hell? Okay, we'll be right behind you. Hassan is with a big titty zombie girlfriend, goth mommy. No, thank you. No zombies. How the fuck am I going to cook both of these? How am I going to sauce them up? Come on. Easy peasy, baby. Rat. Oof. That was fucking... I'm sauce gardener, dude. Hello in there. We're here to help. Please just go away. Let's go, guys. In a minute. Oh my God, she's if such you open a up, classic. We can take you somewhere I can't safe. get along with ladies We've got a group type in chick. Town. No, no, no. Please. She's in trouble. No. Miss, we're coming in. Oh my God. We're here to help. Sorry, whether you like it or not. How does she block the door from the outside is a real question. I think wonder if she's the infected one. You're hurt. Oh god. I I said stay away. We need to get you help. It's too late for that. Guys, she's been bitten. What? I told you I said go away. I'm bit. But you wouldn't just leave. Let's calm down. You could be fine. I won't be fine. My boyfriend was bitten. You get sick and you die and, and you come back and you kill anything you can find. 
You have a boyfriend? Len, I don't want that. It's not Christian. Please, just leave me. Please go. Glenn is horny, bro. Respect. Okay, we'll leave. Just try to take care of yourself for whatever time you have left. You have a gun. So? Can I borrow it? What do you mean, borrow? Give it to me. I can just, you know, end this, and then, and then there's no problem. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Please, I don't want to be one of them. They're, they're satanic. We can't let you do that to yourself. Then do it for me. We need to get going. Yeah, I'd rather kill her. Give it to me, please. Just fucking this is crazy. kill her. Please, step back. It's just two seconds, just one bullet. And I can be with my family and it'll all be fine. Miss. Back up, please. Oh my God. Whoa. <laughs> You're right, I did make a difficult choice. I should have just fucking axed her ass, dude. Whoa, take it easy. We just want to help. You can't. Miss, just relax now. You need to think this through. We'll find you a doctor. It'll be okay. Yeah, okay, oh, dude. Yeah, I got the best zombie no, doctor no. in America, in Atlanta. Bro, come on. Come on. Of course she was supposed to be killed. Like, get the fuck out of here. God damn, Glenn. Weak constitution, my boy. She she heard doctor and thought about the medical bills. Here they come! <laughs> Jesus Christ. Get in. Yeah, the real problem is the fucking noise, dude. That was Everyone a big right? L. Yeah, we had some close calls, but Glenn is fine and well, yeah, we're okay. I've got a few cans of gas for your pickup in the trunk of my car. Good to hear it. And things back here? Quiet. Our friend is still in and out over there. He won't survive any more stress. The next order of business is getting those pills out of the pharmacy. But the real next order of business for now is to... And today's broadcast after a measly 10 hours. Apologies to the chatters who are like, bro, that's a half 